Hi, so my name is Matt Cook. I'm a, a professor of modern history here at Birkbeck and I've been here for uh, 18 years now um, and from the start working on various areas of, of queer history. So um, queer history of Britain, um, I've worked on a book called uh, Queer Domesticities um, and then most recently um, a book called Queer Beyond London. Um, so different dimensions um, of queer history. Um, and in that time I've also been uh, the programme director of um, Burt Beck's flagship Gender and Sexuality Studies programme, which um, has been a fantastic experience. I've learnt so much from the students that have come through Burt Beck, um, and it's really enriched my sense of uh, queer theory, gender theory, um, and, and uh, associated histories. And it's also been a really fascinating time in terms of what's happened more broadly. So in those 18 years, you know, at the very start you know, there wasn't actually that much um, LGBTQ plus history going on in the university sector. Um, so there was loads going on um, um, in community groups, activist groups, um, the heritage and museum sectors after the repeal of Clause 28 were beginning to engage more with LGBTQ history. But it was relatively new in the academy. We'd got history, historians of sexuality and um, working in various positions. But um, over the 18 years since I've been at Birkbeck, I've really clocked how um, across the country um, history departments have increasingly engaged with these really important histories um, and I think their importance has been recognised um, because they're a way of course of remembering and recording um, a really important strand um, of, of our history um, but also because LGBTQ histories help us understand shifting norms and broader changes in culture and society and I think history departments up and down the country and beyond have, have really started to see that and engage with that so it's been a hugely um, exciting um, time to be working in this field um, and I'm really sad now to be leaving Birkbeck um, for a new post at Oxford. Um, it's a professorship in LGBTQ history, uh, the first in the country and I think a testament um, to just where, how far queer history has come um, and um, and how far it's come as a sub-discipline that's both academic and deeply popular, so it's a discipline that really crosses um, the academic and popular public history boundaries. So a really exciting position to be going to, but really sad to be leaving this wonderful um, institution. And, um, and you know, um, the gender sexuality th program is thriving. I'm hoping that for years to come, there'll be a, a really, uh, a real buzz around that program and the students that, uh, that decide to take part in it. And I just wanted to wish everyone a really happy Pride. I'll be marching on, uh, on Saturday and going to Ducky's picnic in Finsbury Square and dancing afterwards. So, um, you know, have a great Pride month um, and wishing you all the very best.